Ava and welcome back to my channel. So today we're trying something new. I know I've been doing a lot of art videos recently, but I really wanted to try and paint records. Like, hold on. Like these ones. I think these are just like a plasticky kind. I don't know if they're actual like records. Some of them actually feel kind of real, but these are just a plastic version. I got these from Amazon for like, I think the whole pack was like $25 and it came with 10 of them. Yeah, I decided to try to paint these and I don't think I've ever seen anyone like paint like big records. I've definitely seen people paint like old CDs, but I haven't seen like big records or anything. But today I wanted to try it and see how it worked out. Also, if you're new here, cause I noticed that I say welcome back to my channel and some of you probably haven't ever been here before. Hi, I'm Ava. I post videos every Wednesday and Friday and they're usually random but I've been doing a lot of art videos recently. But if that interests you, please make sure you hit like and subscribe. And I'm sorry for asking you to like before the video. But yeah, that's pretty much what I do here. I also do like story times, squishy makeovers, gaming videos. Started a sim series. I don't know if I'm going to be continuing that. I hope you like the video and I'm going to shut up now. Hi, welcome to my voiceover. Sorry, I did not know what to say to start this part of the video. That's awkward. But as you saw by the title, I'm painting records today. So here are my sketch ideas for what I wanted to paint on these records. So I decided to start with the cow print design and I just realized that my pencil is cow print. That's, That's cool. But I originally wanted to do like the original black cow print on this one, but then I realized that it wouldn't show up because the records are black. So I just went with strawberry cow- Oh my god, my mouth just made the weirdest noise. Strawberry- Ew, why did it do that? But anyways, I decided to go with a strawberry cow theme, basically just pink cow print. And for this project, I decided to test out my Posca paint pens for the first time. So yeah, it was my first time using these and honestly- oh my eyebrow in the frame i'm sorry but anyways it was my first time using these and honestly i love them so much i'm definitely gonna use these again definitely recommend honestly i don't know why i sketched this out with a pencil beforehand i didn't even follow those lines at all like i painted around them basically this thing's whole painting process was just painting on the cow print painting on a clear layer and then it's over i just chose like really simple designs for these because one i like these designs a lot even if they are simple and two i didn't really want to mess these up all that much but this painting process actually did take a really long time it took me like a week to paint all of these and i know that's not like a long long time but for me usually when i have simple designs they don't usually take this long but it was probably just because i had to do so many coats of paint because these are not covering much so I forgot that Posca pens could leak, but honestly I'm happy that it did because it didn't need that many coats after it leaked all over. Only because it was dispensing more paint than it was before. Since this is such a simple design and there's not really much going on, I'm just gonna let you watch the rest of the painting process with pretty music in the background. So enjoy! that extremely long painting process i went back and erased all of the other lines and honestly it kind of just smudged the record so i went over some of the smudges with the black posca pen 
This probably isn't a very good idea, but I use like fabric glue for like the clear coat. I didn't have gesso or anything, so I tried this out and it honestly kind of works. So I just applied that to the record and the first painting process thingy was finished. So here is the finished painting. This honestly might be my favorite one that I did today. And now for the second one. This one is another very simple design. For this one, I decided to paint some little cartoony flowers on it. I think these are called like the indie aesthetic flowers. At least that's what I call them. And I'm happy I picked this record to do it on because in the end, it kind of matches the little rainbow stripe in the middle. And sorry, I'm not talking much in this video. There's just not much to talk about. But I'm just going to play the little cute music again and let you watch me paint. <laughs> After a million coats, it is finally done. And here's the end result for this one. I really like the way this came out, and I really like that it kind of matches a little my dog's barking. Anyways, I really like that it matches a little stripe in the middle and I just really like how this one came out. Originally, I wasn't going to make the flowers this big, but at least I didn't mess it up that bad. And now moving on to the last design. I have really low expectations for this, but I at least wanted to try. I wanted to do this drip smiley face design because it's like trendy or whatever. And I figured it could be like the hard design for this video after all of the simple designs that I did. This took way more coats than I thought it would, so you know what's coming up next. Hey music.
painting a million yellow coats. I went around the whole design with a black outline like it had in the picture. After that, I tried to add the thick black details like it had in the picture also, but they just weren't working out and they made it look like really tiny and it honestly just didn't look good. So after trying it on this strip, I just stopped trying to do that and honestly, I think that made the design look kind of weird, but hey. What can you do? So now it's time for me to draw the face. Just apologies in advance for this. I really don't like the way this one came out in the end. Spoiler alert. It just didn't come out the way I wanted it to and it just looked really dumb in the end and and the mouth oh my god don't even get me started the mouth was such a nightmare because I didn't know how to draw it and then I made the mistake of just scribbling and it turned into a chunky mess this design is literally just the pictures ugly twin and I ended up making the eyes too small so I just went back and fixed that and here is the final result this one's honestly my least favorite like I did a decent job but it just looks ugly to me well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please make sure you hit like and subscribe and follow me on everything else. If you want more painting videos or you want a part two of this video, please make sure you comment and let me know. All right, I love you guys. Bye.